Imagine robots that can zoom faster than Olympic sprinters or figure out tricky puzzles in no time at all. The world of robots is moving ahead super fast. Today, we are about to dive into something awesome, the seven fastest robots ever made. Trust me, you'll be amazed at what these robots can do. Welcome to Superstructures. Let's get started on this exciting journey. Let's meet number seven on our list, Mabel. Mabel is a special kind of robot created by clever folks at the University of Michigan. This robot has changed the way we learn about how humans walk and run. Unlike regular robots, Mabel does things differently. It uses a clever trick called passive dynamic walking. This means it moves a lot like how people move, using gravity and momentum, not motors or outside forces. This makes Mabel's walking style smooth and natural. Mabel can go pretty fast, up to 6.8 miles per hour, and its unique way of walking is a treasure for scientists who study how humans move. It helps them learn cool stuff about walking and running mechanics. Mabel has been part of many research projects. It has checked out how different shoes affect walking, figured out the nitty-gritty of walking and running on bumpy ground, and even looked into how robots could be used in physical therapy. But there's more to Mabel than just copying humans. Its way of moving has led to smart ideas for helping people who have trouble moving around. By watching Mabel, scientists can come up with new ideas and gadgets to make walking and running easier for folks who need a hand. Moving on to number 6, we have Atreus. This cool creation comes from the smart folks at Oregon State University and Agility Robotics. Atreus has a really neat trick up its sleeve. It copies how humans walk and run super closely. And guess what? Its name stands for Assume the Robot is a Sphere. That might sound strange, but it's all about how the robot looks from above. A bit like a sphere. It's got a walking style that's like a spring and a weight. This helps it save and release energy in its legs, making its moves efficient. Plus, Atreus is quite an adaptable explorer. It can handle changes on the ground, which makes it super handy for search and rescue missions. And guess what's even cooler? If it gets pushed or tripped, Atreus can recover all by itself using some pretty smart control tricks. Atreus can run up to 6.8 miles per hour. Scientists have used this robot for all sorts of studies. They've checked out different ways to control its movements, looked into how robots could help in physical therapy, and more. Its unique skills make it a promising pal for future robot and mobility research. Who knows, it might even help find new ways to make prosthetics and rehab better for folks who need them. Number 5 brings us to Sub 1, a standout robot born from the creative minds of the German tech company Infineon. This robot is a real looker, with a special round shape and six arms curving inwards at different angles. This unique design makes Sub 1 super flexible and innovative. What makes Sub 1 really special is its microcontroller brain. Those arms? They can actually move, and they do it quick. This lets Sub 1 do specific tasks at lightning speed. But here's the kicker. Sub 1 made quite the splash when it nailed solving the Rubik's Cube puzzle in no time. How? It's got some tiny computer chips and camera eyes that help it see and solve problems. This means Sub 1 can handle complex jobs with total precision. Remember the Electronica trade fair in Munich? Infineon showed off Sub 1 there, and Joss dropped when the robot solved the Rubik's Cube in just 0.637 seconds. That's a new Guinness World Record! To compare, the fastest human solver took 4.74 seconds. Sub 1's achievement is like a high five to the future. But this robot isn't just about puzzles. Its blazing speed and spot on accuracy could shake up industries like manufacturing, logistics, and healthcare. Let's dive into number 4 Wildcat. This incredible robot is brought to you by Boston Dynamics and has four legs that are just raring to go outside. Imagine this. It can zoom at an unbelievable 16 miles per hour on flat ground. Wildcat is no ordinary bot. It's got hydraulic and electric muscles that work together like a dream. They keep it moving and balanced while it dashes around. And guess what? Wildcat shapes and smarts let it conquer all kinds of places, from bumpy lands to steep hills. It even breezes through uneven surfaces without a hitch. This robot's got a cool party trick too. It can deal with obstacles that are as high as 33 centimeters. It can scoot through tight spaces and climb over stuff like it's no big deal. This makes it a star player in lots of fields, like search and rescue, military missions, and exploring new territories. 
Wildcat's balance and stability, even when it goes zooming, it stays super steady thanks to smart sensors, clever software, and those hydraulic and electric muscles. Here we are at number 3, the Outrunner. This special robot comes from a crew led by Sebastian Cotton at Robotics Unlimited. Now, don't be fooled by its size. It's just 3 pounds light and stands less than 2 feet tall. But boy does it pack a punch. It can blaze along at speeds reaching 20 miles per hour. And it does it by switching its feet. The Outrunner isn't a sprinter. It's got some real endurance. It can keep on trucking for a full 2 hours on just one battery charge. That's a lot of ground covered. It's got this sleek black look that kind of reminds you of the famous Pac-Man game. On the sides, there are motors and brains, and six legs pop out from each spinning motor. Right now, it functions via radio control, but the smart folks behind the OutRunner are cooking up an app. Yep, soon you'll be able to control it using your phone or Wi-Fi. The team that made this magic is part of the Florida Institute for Human and Machine Cognition. They've got big plans for their creation. Even though it might seem like a cool gadget, the OutRunner is no joke. It can really step up when things get tough, like in search and rescue or exploring tricky lands. With its zippy speed and staying power, this little bot could be a real game changer in all kinds of places. The OutRunner proves just how amazing robots can be and how they might be the superheroes we need. Moving on to number 2, let's meet the Raptor. This incredible creation comes straight from the MSc lab at the Korea Advanced Institute of Science and Technology in South Korea. They took a cue from the lightning-fast velociraptors you might remember from Jurassic Park. The raptors got two legs, and they're built to move like a reptile's legs. Each leg is powered by just one motor, and they've got a neat trick. Imagine an Achilles tendon. It's a bit like that and helps the robot keep steady as it moves. The raptor's feet are made from super strong carbon fiber that's also lightweight. It's like the cool prosthetic legs amputees use, all flexible and slender. And here's a fun twist. It's got a tail. It's like a stabilizer, hanging out on the robot's right side around where its hip would be. Hold on to your seats, the raptor can hit speeds of up to 28.5 miles per hour. That's some speedy moves right there. Right now, it's got a leash. Well, kind of. It's connected to a power and control unit. But guess what? The smart minds behind it want to set it free. They're working on letting it roam without strings. Now imagine the speedy creature in action. It could be a hero in search and rescue missions or even military ops, where speed and agility are the keys. The Raptor's special design and skills make it an exciting piece of the robotics puzzle. It's a glimpse into the future of what these amazing machines can do. And here we are at number 1, the mighty MIT Cheetah. This stunning creation comes straight out of the genius minds at MIT. With a little help from the US Department of Defense's Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency. Picture this, a robot with a big rectangular body and not one, not two, but 12 super strong motors. Oh, and it's got a tiny chip with super smarts. This chip controls how the robot moves, how much force it uses, and even how it walks, runs, and jumps. Plus, there are special sensors that send info to the motors and the boss of the robot, the onboard computer. This cheetah doesn't mess around. It can really sprint, hitting speeds of 29.2 miles per hour. And check this out. It can leap over stuff that's as tall as 16 inches. What's really cool is how the MIT cheetah mimics the moves of a real cheetah, the fastest land animal on Earth. The MIT crew looked at how cheetahs dash and twist at top speeds, and they made a robot that does the same. It's not just fast, it's flexible, quick, and smart too. It's like having a real-life superhero on your team. This robot could be a hero in all sorts of places, like carrying stuff for the military or helping out in search and rescue missions. The folks at MIT say this robot's tech could flip the script on how we use robots in the future. We hope you've had a blast on this exhilarating journey. From robots that sprint like cheetahs to the futuristic outrunner, the world of robotics keeps delivering jaw-dropping marvels. And guess what? The adventure is far from over. Who knows what mind-boggling creations await us in the future? One thing's certain, the quest for speed and smarts in robotics is far from finished. If you've enjoyed this ride as much as we have, don't miss out. Hit that subscribe button for superstructures, stay tuned, and be ready to witness the next changing invention in the incredible world of robotics.
Thanks for joining us and remember, the future is full of possibilities.